We've got three people, all right, that you know mm. that have sent in questions. Oh no! And I'm going to let you choose who you want to hear first. Okay. So we have Rita Aurora. Okay. She sent a question. Mm. We have a question for you from Harry Styles. Okay. He sent a question. Yep. And we have a question from Jack Whitehall. Oh god. It's a good three. <laughs> oh, that's it's a, a bad, good three. That's a bad three. All of them, when I asked as well, <laughs> were overjoyed oh, no. to ask you a question. Okay. They were like, "Give me a minute." <laughs> <laughs> Who would you like first? Let's go with young Harold Styles. Okay. Hi, James. <laughs> Harold here. <laughs> what our readers would like to know is, who is your least favourite carpool karaoke guest? Ooh. Oh, oh I mean, what? the cheek of the boy, because he knows you. the answer. All you've done for him. Oh and that's man! The question. I just can't. I can't. It's too. It's too. Um, yeah, there was one I listened to, but I'm. I'm never going to tell you. Mariah. I don't want to. No, I'm I not. Gonna, I'm not going to tell you. I'm not. All gonna of tell One Direction. You. I'm not going to tell you. I'm, I genuinely I mean, we wouldn't. Could. I wouldn't do such a it's thing. It's for Harry and his readers. I love Harry and his readers. No, no one knows how much I love Harry more than his readers. But I refuse. I do not want to answer okay, it. Okay, it's a no, Harry. Harry's readers. It's a no. What a little snide. He knows the answer. <laughs> he knows. Um, okay, who do you want next? Do you want Rita or do let's you go, want Let's go Rita. Let's go Rita. Okay, here we go. Hey, James Corden. It's me, Rita Aura here. I just want to ask you, what do you think is your worst on-screen slash embarrassing anything you can say moment? I really want to know because I feel like you've had a few. <laughs> See you later, mate. <laughs> That's my worst on-screen moment. Worst, we, has there been any moments? Are or we ex well, uh, are any we, moments. Let's I mean, just take the lesbian vampire killers out of that because <laughs> I think we can all agree that was a worst moment for anyone involved. I'm but, yet to see. Oh, well, lucky you. <laughs> <laughs> My first sort of time I was on TV, I, I won a competition to be on Good Morning with Anne and Nick Amazing. as a child, and I interviewed Meatloaf. And Amazing. I fear that should that interview ever resurface, it would be the most embarrassing thing I could find, I imagine. How old were you when you interviewed Meatloaf? I think I was about... 14, Amazing. something like that. You know Radio 1 are now like... Brrr. And I'll be bringing you all the top gossip, plus an exclusive interview with Meatloaf. Do you prefer performing uh, or... To, to doing all the, the promotional side of things, is, is that what you really love? Promotion tour, you want to do this, James. Yeah. This is what you want to do here. You better hold this. Just right. hold this for a second. Because during a promotion tour, this is exactly what you want to do. Okay, final question. Jack okay. Whitehall has this for oh, you, God. James. I'm so you, worried I, about the, what he's yeah, about to say. Jimbo, <laughs> which of 1D's first solo singles did you find the toughest to listen to? <laughs> Ooh, he's gonna have to upset one of One Direction. He doesn't like that. <laughs> I mean, I mean that's brutal. I mean, I think that's brutal. That's brutal. This is here's my answer. Okay, come on. Here's my answer. Okay, okay. Because I'm a directioner. Uh -huh. You know this. Yeah, I know. Yeah. In my head, there's still a five. Yes. There's five members. Yes. So for me, the hardest to listen to mm -hmm. was Pillow Talk by Zayn mm -hmm. because I had to at that moment take it on board and finally realise that they were no longer a five. Mm -hmm. Times had changed. And what was hardest about it was I was loving it. Pillow time! It's amazing. Fantastic. And at that moment it became real to me uh -huh. that sooner or later you and me have got a whole lot of history. Mm -hmm. Hello. Good morning, Grimmy. The Radio 1 breakfast Another one. James Corden is our guest today. Good morning. That's a very egotistical bit of propaganda that I just I like played it. to. Anything that you can get DJ Khaled just saying, another one. We the best. Yeah. No, he says it for everyone, but I do take that as a personal compliment.